well, by the time June rolls around, Jake, you're gone and will soon be appearing for the WCCW territory. And I believe it was going to be August of 84. <coughs> well, um, you know why I left, don't you? That's what I was just about to ask. What happened? <clears throat> well, I went to WTBS to do TV one morning, and guess who's there? Who? This big man. Okay, that Black Saturday or whatever they call yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, he bought it out. Wow. And I took my book and I tore it up in front of him, told him to shove it up his ass. <laughs> what? Yeah, real smart, wasn't I? <laughs> so, wait a minute, why, why do that? Because I was pissed off, man. My fucking job just disappeared. I had all these plans, all these things in my mind ready to go. And it was just all fucked in one fell swoop. Yeah, I was getting ready to turn Nikolai Volkov babyface. Man, imagine. I was going to have him sing in church. <laughs> at Tim Horner's church. Wow. While Tim was on piano. So how, how far in advance were you booking? My mind books six, eight months in advance. That's incredible. That's how far I looked out. So six, eight months right down the tubes in all yeah. in one moment. Yeah. Yeah. Now at the time, you know, Vince is taken over up in New York. I yeah. mean, you didn't have any kind of like in saying, fuck this guy. Well, yeah. you didn't have any worry about like, uh, can mess with me in the future. Nope. Well, evidently it didn't. I mean, wasn't real, it wasn't real smart on my behalf. To tell you the truth. Maybe not. Cause I could have been up there two years sooner. God imagine. I mean, some of the shit that was going on up there that you could have been, I mean, that right when Hulkamania was heating up. Yeah. You could have been there, man. It could have been a big part of that. Big what if. I mean, all's well that ends well. You yeah. uh, you ended up doing okay. 